Hey, what's up, coach? Welcome back to the Six Figure Trainer Podcast. My name is Ben Neighbors, and today I'm going to show you my two favorite ways to run your free eval sessions and turn your prospects that come into these sessions into clients. Today's episode is sponsored by MakeMoneyCoachingSports.com. Simply head over to MakeMoneyCoachingSports.com right now and access my free webinar where we break down exactly how to grow your company to six figures and beyond. It's going to be really important that when you go through this video, you choose just one of these options. Don't try to do both of them at the same time. That will confuse you and it will confuse your prospect. So just choose one. One way is simple. One way is more advanced. Uh, the more advanced way, it just requires that you have specific technology to actually be able to pull it off. Otherwise, you shouldn't try it at all. All right. So the first way that we want to do this is really simple. All right. Let's pretend that you're talking to a new parent. They are interested in your program and you have a free eval session and that's like the first step that you offer them now the thing that you need to do is when you speak with the parent you need to let them know that the session is free if they take advantage and attend that session by a certain date otherwise they can come to the session and they can pay for it later right and this way you put value on the free session and let's say it's fifty dollars normally and if they don't sign up or they don't show up this week to take advantage of it, it's $50 next week. This is the thing that gets them to come into the session quickly versus just saying it's free and then them not showing up. Because that's a big problem that a lot of coaches have is they offer free sessions, but there's no urgency. So you can add urgency when you talk to a parent over the phone. And the easiest way to do that is just be like, hey, as long as you guys come this week, this session is free. And if you can come by this date, that you're gonna have a free session. If you come beyond that date, it's you can still come to the eval session, but it's $50 or it's $100, whatever you decide that number to be. And this way, the parent takes it more serious. Now, what you wanna do on that call is you wanna be able to ask them questions, get an understanding of what their child needs help with, and don't just sell them the free eval session. You need to gather information. And it's also good, in my opinion, to talk about the details of your program before they show up to the free eval. Because what you don't want to do is you don't want someone to just come into your eval session and then feel like you have to sell them after that. That's not what you should do. You should try to sell them before they come to the session. And this way, when they show up to the eval, when they like it, they're already sold on your process. They know the investment. They know the commitment. All those things are in order before they show up. That's like my recommended way of doing this. So you don't just have people coming into your eval session and then you have to close them later down the road. That is much tougher to do because a lot of parents will get sticker shock, which is like, they're going to see the price after the eval and be like, oh man, this is like way too much. We're not going to do it. Then you're wasting our time. So you want to just go over those details before they show up to the eval and you want to have urgency on that eval. That's the first way of doing it. The second way of doing it, if you find today's video helpful, hit that subscribe button. And if you want more free information about how to grow your coaching business, head over to makemoneycoachingsports.com. You need like software like Samcart. Um, you could also look at something like Pro Coach Connector. That's something that we're coming out with. Um, and this is set up to where when you talk to the parent, you send them to a checkout page. And on the checkout page, it says $0. But what they do is they give you their credit card information. And so they have to give you their credit card information to show up to the eval. All right, so they do that before they come to the eval session and that secures their spot. And then you can set up the page to where in seven days from now, they're gonna be automatically billed the first month of training. This way you already have their credit card information before they show up to the eval. And this is good for people that want more of a serious commitment before the eval session happens. And I know what you might be thinking. You might be like, well, no one's going to give me their credit card before they show up to this thing. I mean, the reality is they will. You just haven't tried it yet. All right. So the first way is you just get them to kind of lock in and, and get them to come to the eval session. Otherwise, if they miss it, it's X amount of dollars next week. Um, the second way is you collect their credit card info, info before they show up and then you automatically bill them seven days or 14 days later, however long your, your eval period is. Um, and that way it's just easier to enroll them as a client because you already have their info. All right. So those are my two favorite ways. I hope this video helped you. If you want more help with your business, 
send me a text message this number right here i'd love to connect with you i'd love to chat with you learn more about what you're doing and see how we can help that's it catch you later